My legs in the front shot? Uh, no, not totally. You stay left. <laughs> <laughs> that might help. All right, that's pretty good. All right, so how to breathe on the bike. You always want to breathe with an open mouth. If your mouth is closed, you cannot burn the fat as effectively if your mouth's open. So you want to make sure you have your mouth open, relaxed. Never close the mouth shut. Otherwise, you just go back in so much harder because you can't get the oxygen. Oxygen is where the power comes from. When the riders and swimmers and runners take EPO, it's for oxygen ability. Increase the red blood cell, which increases the oxygen uptake, transfer, delivery to the cells, which increases your power. So you always want to have a mouth, open mouth, breathe from the belly. If someone says breathe through your nose, keep your mouth shut, they got no fucking clue. They got no fucking clue. Open mouth, watch Lance Armstrong, watch all the fucking hitters. Open mouth, relax. The breathing cycle is basically in, out, in, out. It's like a metronome. You feel like, <laughs> that's too fast. Slow it down. In, out, in, out. And that's what you want to say. Just remember that, in, out, in, out. That's what Lance Armstrong's doing. That's what everyone's doing. If you want to get leaner, breathe through your mouth. Do in, out, in, out. A small percentage has come from your nose, but it's from your mouth. It's from your mouth. And uh, we're breathing from the belly. The belly's gonna go in and out. In, out, in, out. So it's coming from the belly. And that's pretty much it. In, out, breathe from the belly, and stay relaxed. Make sure your upper body's relaxed. And you need a gear where you can spin at least 80 to 90 cadence. Maybe 100 if you're a bit more. Pushing more watts, and uh, that's how we do it. And they can do the albatross.